Welcome to the Windows Computer Technology Channel, and I think this would be a good warning video. For those of you that are in the um, buying of maybe a new CPUs or buying a new computer with uh, some of the latest Intel CPUs, uh, Intel might be having a problem with its uh, CPUs, the 13900K and 14900K. Uh, processors, it seems that a very high crashing rate and failure rate is happening on those two uh, new uh, 13th, 14th generation CPUs. And it started all with uh, a company called Alderon Games that says that it noted that there were a lot more crashes suddenly on the Intel processors. And of course, um, another techie that talked at Tom's Hardware uh, website also mentioned something's weird and wrong. And more and more voices are saying that the latest 13th, 14th generation Intel processors are probably maybe overclocked, not running well, and even degrading over time and creating a host of issues from all sorts of lockdowns, blue screens, uh, playing games saying that you're running out of uh, video RAM, all sorts of very bizarre things. And as time goes by, it's worse and worse. So I would actually maybe wait. Uh, Intel is saying that it is investigating the issue, that it's uh, looking at what's happening. But right now, more and more voices are saying that Intel is having problems. So maybe you better put off that buying of a new 13th, 14th generation CPU for a while because it does seem something's really wrong and that uh, more and more voices are saying that it, it just doesn't work. It's like, you know, crashing all the time and the reliability goes down. So it's as if the processor itself is actually kind of almost, you know, destroying itself. It's really, really an issue that Intel needs to look at. So we'll follow this story because it is interesting. And, you know, buying hardware, especially when you buy the latest hardware, it's kind of expensive. You don't want to have, you know, some hardware that crashes all the time. So uh, we'll be looking at that. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe. Give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.